Peggy 18. It'll be a rough trip. It used to be to go straight up Clavering Boulevard, but now it's not so easy. Half the city's dead of the plague. The other half's fighting over what's left. City Watch still holds the bigger streets, and they've set up those wall of light checkpoints. A man walks through one of those, and he ends up burned to a crisp. Everything not controlled by the City Watch is gang territory. Then there are the real odd birds living on the fringes, like that Granny Rags. They say she's nuts. Don't know which is worse. You just take your pick. Inspected them myself. Keep working. Well, he ain't moving no more. <laughs> One, two, three, heave! Attention, they are raw and scarred from the washing. Please, Please override still water to the approaches I saw some safety. terrible Be things today. Be advised that such vehicles will not slow or stop to avoid citizens obstructing the way. I can't believe the way people act in the middle of a terrible situation like this. Keep them coming. One, two, three, heave.
Attention Dunwall citizens, this is a special announcement from our Honorable Lord Regent. This is the Lord Regent speaking. It is with regret that I announce that my term as Lord Regent has been extended through the month of harvest and potentially beyond. In addition, in this continuing crisis, the overseers of the Abbey of the Everyman remain in service to the state and are empowered to enforce court order whenever and wherever necessary. We owe our thanks to High Overseer Campbell for the generous loan of their services. Granny, Granny, come out with me instead. Granny, 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 you can't because you're dead. Oh no, that's not a nice thing. Just garbage. Garbage, 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 garbage. All of it. Hmm. Yes, I would indeed. Granny, 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 come out. Granny, Granny, I think the little birdies are sad today. Dear? Is that you, my dear husband? Oh, my eyes aren't what they used to be. Have you seen my little birdies? Oh, the dear things must be starving without their granny. Here, birdies. Here. Oh, my, my, my. I think I have gentlemen callers again, but not the way I used to, not the nice ones. I hear them, and they're not very polite ones, either. Granny Rags, Granny Rags, let us in. Ah, oh, well, they'll go away again if they know what's good for them, but what a bother. Here's the key to the front door, love. You'll see to those ruffians, won't you? Just garbage. Garbage, 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 garbage. All of it. The little birdies are sad today. Let us in, Granny! She can't even hear us. She's blind. I'm deaf. We're here to do your washing. She's not stupid either. Have it your way. We're here to take your money, Granny. We're wasting our time. How much could she have? She did Would you look at this? You don't walk into Bottle Street looking like that. That outfit must have cost a lot. Maybe I'll let my girlfriend wear it. Somebody, get over here! I'm gonna loot you! Oh, my 
dear. I knew you'd help me with those ill-mannered boys. My brave man. Listen, Granny has a birthday present for you. I got it from the outsider, and now I'm giving it to you. Go on. It's upstairs. On the vanity. I think you'll cut a nice figure with it. Remember how we used to dance? Our parties were even grander than those at the Boyle Manor. Everyone wanted to come. I told you the knives go on the left. They've always gone on the left. You never listen. I hope you like the little gift I got for you. It's the least I could do for turning those louts away. I can't bear these Bottle Street children. Ruffians, every last one of them. Rotten apples. And that slack jaw is the worst of the lot. You know what I just thought of? You could do something else for me. Another little favor. And I'd give you another present. Another lovely rune carved from the bones of a dead whale. Do you remember my doctor, dear? Dr. Galvani? Now there was a clever man. He's got all sorts of nasty rat guts and disease in his laboratory. Wouldn't it be a shame if some of that mess found its way into the Bottle Street Gang's elixir still? That'd teach him. See to it, dear. I'll find you another present just like the first. Galvani lives on Clavering Boulevard, or at least he used to. Those were the days. Now run off. My baby birdies are hungry. So precious. Hmm. But they're shy. You have to go or they will come. talk to us like that. Fact is, Bottle Street is here to take its cut. So reach it to your pockets and let's get... Yeah, 
And the inspection fee. We can't help it. Just the way we do things. Somebody, give me a hand. Die, you fool. Oh, I'm trapped. Uh. Out! I owe you, brother. I won't ask about the mask. I wouldn't want my face seen either, pulling a stunt like that. You know what? I'll return the favor. Come by Griff's shop. That's my business. Well, it was, at one time. But now I'm reduced to scavenging things from here and there as the city dies. If you need anything, I wouldn't mind trading for a little money. Maybe someday the plague will blow over and everything will go back to normal. But until then, it's scavenging for me.
Want to look at some of the things I found? Good prices, I swear. off by the overseers. Attention Dunwall citizens, the following businesses have been closed and impounded by the state due to contamination. Barrow's Barbershop and Surgery, the Duke and Dancer Ale House, Merritt's Printing Firm, Pennyworth's Tack and Saddle Emporium, and the Smoke Street Dice Hall. So 